okay guys i know i'm a fucking hypocrite okay um this is really annoying put that up okay you guys i know i talked about i kind of talked shit about getting a uh cut my hair excuse me i know i talked shit about getting a bbl done why my face looks so damn shiny Anyways, I know I talked about getting a BBL done in Tijuana and saying like, oh my God, it's like, the only reason why I was talking shit about getting a, B talking shit about getting a BBL done in Tijuana is because they take out all your fat. They just take out so much fat more than they would do here in the U.S. That's why I'm like, oh my God, it's a health, ri health, health risk. You know, that's the only thing I was saying bad about getting your, your, your BBL. Oh my God. Uh oh, getting your BBL done in Tijuana. But. I'm gonna get my BBL done in Tijuana. Oh my God. I'm gonna get my BBL done in Tijuana by Dr. Pantosha. Okay. Here goes his little Instagram right here. If I could get it there. I hope I could get it there when I edit. Anyways, so um Dr. Pandosha, I'm gonna go to him. Okay, the reason why I'm gonna go to him is because for one thing, he's certified. Um, he's been doing BBLs for a long time. He has no deaths on his hands. You know what I'm saying? The only complaints that people have talked shit about him doing were um, nose operations, no procedures on the nose. I forgot what that's called. But um, he don't really do too many nose surgeries. You know what I'm saying? What he really does a lot of are BBLs and breast amputations. So um, there's a loud ass car right there. Like, oh my God. So anyways, um, yeah, so, um, and I was thinking too, like, there's so many botched story jobs here in the U.S. Like, there's so many girls getting botched here in the U.S. Oh my god, my god. <clears throat> I've been trying to get away from this too. Believe it's not easy. So, anyways, um, there's a lot, a lot of botched stories that I heard here in the U.S. about girls getting fucked up. You know what I'm saying? And there's a lot of shank, shady, fake doctors out here in the U.S. that are doing plastic surgery. You know what I mean? So I mean like because you hear Tijuana people get like, oh my god, Tijuana, oh my god, so scared, oh bootleg and sick. Oh, oh, oh. But they do BBLs out there. And they do a pretty good job. I mean they I mean Dr. Pandosha does a pretty good job and I trust him, you know what I mean? And um he's right there on the border of um he's actually right there on, on Baja he's in Baja, California. And um, so I'm gonna get my BBL there, you guys. Um, I have decided to do it. I'm still trying to gain weight for the procedure and keep it. Um, my original weight is 140. I was too skinny. The doctor said I had to gain weight. Um, this was two years ago. So I've been trying to gain weight and, and hold it for the past two years, you know? And I've been doing my research on the doctors and shift during those times. You know, maybe I wanna go to this doctor. But I always came back to Dr. Pandosha. All the time. It gets kind of hot. Um, sorry for the noise out there. But I always find myself coming back to Dr. Pandosia, you know? So that's what I'm going to go to. I'm going to stick with. And um, I'm going to bring you guys along on my journey. I'm going to let you guys know what, um, you know, my, what I'm going to bring. My, um, all my um, products I need to buy for the freaking surgery, after surgery. I'm gonna, we're gonna, I'm gonna film all that shit when I get to it. So, um, yeah, I just want to let you guys know that. And he do charge cheap. He's, he's not that expensive. Last time he told me, um, when I spoke to them in the office, it was around $5,000 to do the BBO. So, um, yeah. Hope this video could help someone out. Peace out, toodles, and happy trails to all my happy trailers. Bye.